there is a God in heaven. I don't know what to tell you. I didn't have the only I didn't have anything hadi ya kuongea ingine wakati mwingine unaongea di mate inaisha mimi siko hiyo niko na mate mingi by the way ya kiufala hivyo kwanza hadi ya di mate inajichora huku juu venye una try ku explain kitu yenye kitu yenye haiko you know i really understand a life was lost in my in my apartment but listen for instance right now kila mtu alikuwa analia na mimi pesa yenye niliguza hiyo wakati sijaiguza kwa maisha yangu ngapi ah tingapi mse usikuwa <laughs> no, by then you know eh. uh, nikisema pesa na manisha watu wengine walikuwa wajaribu kutafuta hadi food hiyo time ya covid yeah. Yeah. mi hiyo time manga ikitoka natumiwa doa hadi na mafana natumiwa ka, ka 50000 a day hakuna kazi nimeenda hakuna kitu nimefanya kila mzee unaona hadi wase wa club you came you did everything and then the big story that happened was jeff uh, god rest his soul you've spoken about it in different media spaces i think one yeah. do you feel like when you are talking about it you are not the people interviewing you are biased ama they never <laughs> gave you an open platform to express yourself you know uh everybody has their own perspective yeah yeah kitu yeah uh, when they were interviewing me or whoever was interviewing me i just feel uh, they had already made up their mind uh, uh, are you gay <laughs> Podo. It's your boy the chairman of the top of Gobina. Welcome to another lumpious episode of the Kula Kula show. Tuko tayari kukula unaona mpaka ba tumenawisha we at Miale Resort. Yes. Bado ni Miale 72. Ama ilipanda ikafika 73. Bado tuko 72. Iko loving town. Yes, and for today's episode I have the one and only wewe DJ Fat so Karibu yes. my brother. Asante. Tukisha na bado za tunaweza gota. Kabisa. Karibu. So this one is called Miale special eh? Yes. So tuko hapa kukula. Mimi nikwambia ukuje kama una njaa. Sasa hii weka hapa. Mm. Hiyo inaitwa saute. Hii ni cream spinach. Tuanze baba. We hey, told you to come here when you are hungry mm. to kule. And I am. <laughs> tule, tule, am. tule 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 tule. Mimi I love this one. Thank Kwa ni kija hapa wanaambia tu Miale special. Uh-huh. Hii ndio mimi wanapita nayo. Very nice. That's right. Mm. Umekwaje? Niko salama. Mm. 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 kuku. Mpenda mguu. Kwa hiyo mguu imechoka aje. Jeer lives. Not bad, not bad. I'm loving it. It's tasty. Umeka mapa? Yeah, nimekuja. Mhm. Well, remember. Sambo nilikuwa nilikuwa nafanya um, DJ na I used to work for Pierre Makena. Oh. So in the local area in the joint yeah. yeah. That's mm. true. Mm. Mm. Very nice, very nice. I like it. Thank you. Karibu. Mbona ita DJ Fatso? Wewe si mnono? Sasa kai ndo tabia nitakosaje kwa chat. Mimi si pia mimi nilikuwa naitwa Ubina Patso. Mimi the first time I heard about you used to have a new lingine hivi. Mhm. I love this DJ Patso. Mara nje DJ Patso. Because the people I know that are Patso, mm-hmm. are Jiti Patso. Mhm. Ana blue. <laughs> yeah, where did the name come from? When I was a young boy, uh-huh. Uh huh. Uh. To the na maboy ingi na nuka shags. Uh huh. So nilikuwa kaki jana kapum pum. Sana. <laughs> you say? I'm telling you, it's the fact. Uh-huh. Sasa, you know, if you want a nickname to stick, ikatai. 
So they used to call me for Tona Kazirika sana, actually, in any Nyumbani. So they had to annoy me all the time. When I Calling you the same name. So in Fatso came like a core. By the Up to date. So when you're in the Usanin, you Ah. Sit a change. Why not? At an end, I cannot know. But then, most of the time, mm. when people diss you, then you own the diss. Like me, I own Father I, Abraham. I, dangi, I yeah. know. I yeah, know. Like, you know, Father Abraham, we're going to have to I'm like, yes. <laughs> so now there's Ogadi Top, Father Abraham, reporting for duty. <laughs> so there's nothing more you can tell me. You're mm. like, ah, Nisawa. That's then it. Then you move on. So you're a footballer. I'm a two-year-old game. For fun. For fun. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm. Then you became a DJ. I became That was one. direct after school? Direct after Form 4. Yeah. Uh, I got done with my form for back in 2013. Okay. I'm <laughs> So, uh, after I'm going to go to the movies. I'm going to go I did that. I'm so good at that. So. For you? I swear to God. Hey, book dogo? <laughs> <laughs> Hmm? <laughs> hmm? You eh, eh. <laughs> don't no, see you do it. All right, check him on and all. But she, oh, oh. I, I used to do it. Uh -huh. Now, who chakula, yeah, miyale kiweza kufika kwenye meza. Ah, uh, yeah, it was. <laughs> Hassala. We all used to emulate that guy by the name DJ Afro. Yeah. Because DJ Afro is a legend. He's a that. legend, true, true. A big shout out to him. He's my good friend because Alicia Gunishika Mkona Sana. So I used to do that and then Nikaona Badu Kunakiti Nyasi feel. You kitu ya DJ Afro? Yeah. You watch movie Yota in Aisha? Yeah. And then now you start again? You watch it in a, in a kuapi? Upper, kwa yeah. kitchen. So, unanza fresh sasa, ukitangazi ya watu. And in fact, kuna siku unge watch movie kangapi? Uh, ka, ka tatu uh -huh. ili utangazia watu juu na huko kwetu kuna kuna videos yenye unaendanga unalipisha watu na watu wakubwa yeah. 10 bob ama 20 bob kulingana na oh. size ya movie so a whole day unapata maybe maybe utatangaza movie tatu so itabidi uzi watch zote zika hapa then so ilikuwa like live concert it is a live movie concert. unaitangaza live yes it is Cheki maneno. Bashi oh oh katika vipindi za art production. <laughs> Kule kashkazini kushini magaribi mwa China tunakutana na Bruce Uli ah uh, maridadi kabisha. <laughs> <laughs> Sasa huyo jamaa alivoko. <laughs> Hakasema hema. <laughs> Aligongwa kama darama za haleluya. <laughs> ah, Taki DJ Afro wana ni Maliza. DJ Afro is a legend. Hey, hey, hey. Sofa, did Kemoda. Leto ni gombe DJ Afro. <laughs> Anisa tangaza kitu hapo mge mekana wazai. <laughs> Kuna time. <laughs> Let me tell you. <laughs> There is a time. <laughs> There is a time ali tangaza anga. <laughs> Because, you know, I used to watch him because I used to love him so much. Because, yeah. um, he has a place. 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 Nilishanga Givinyaku. Nilishanga Kanyaka Chini. Givinyaku Nimi. Givinyaku means a member. DJ Afro for you. Eh, sasa yeah. kashana. Kalavu <laughs> anasemanga akamuoga kwa makagari. <laughs> aka akamwangalia. Akasema kwisha maneno. Sasa kashana karibudho ororo. <laughs> eh, hey, kugudhana na ororo. Sasa <laughs> I love to look for DJ Afro. Tata mleta hapa. Is it kama his normal? So that's the hustle you are doing. Yeah. Because you followed in his footsteps. Aka sika because you are doing the same thing. No, I didn't used to do like him. At least I used to do it like me. I love being me. So yako ilikuwa gani? Sasa, because it's a DJ Afro. Nita movie moja yangu, utaonyesha watazamaji. Eh. But I didn't used to copy his voice. Unajua kuna ile? Oh. I used to take him as a role model, but I didn't used to copy the way he does his thing. 
Oh, yako ilikuwa na accent ya Kisapere? Hapana. Ah, Ama yako ilikuwa? Si unaleta tu kiuketo na unaleta tu janja yako. Hii hati ni janja. Okay. Hata mtu mwingine atokea kesho ajite obina. I try to copy yeah, easy to copy yeah. but akijita obina na kuna ka uniqueness fulani kenye kanafanya kako tofauti na wewe but bado inaonekana kametoka kwako yeah. bado atapata mafunzo bado atapata yeah okay yeah karibu sana dj <laughs> <laughs> afro patso <laughs> patso fro yeah uh-huh. so uh, this is kula kula show Chenye wanafanya si uka hapa tunacheka tunakumbuka them days and mm. then also we ask general knowledge questions. Yeah. The reason why we ask this is not to show how sharp someone is mm. is for fun mm. because maswali unaweza maswali za nursery surely. Mm. Maswali very simple. For example, types of soil. <laughs> Can you remember the types? <laughs> uh-huh. Clay. Clay. Uh-huh. Oh my god. <laughs> you know, leave God out of this. Uh-huh. Clay. Uh-huh. School fees, I'm going to to So, clay, loamy, sandy. Oh, yeah. See, there so they are very simple questions, but Mutana Kachi is my guy, Sikumbuki. Sure. So, if you ask a question, no machine of Kupata right, Unawacha Kukula. Ah, Sungoja Kwanza to Kula Kuli. That's why I never Kula Kula. Una Lema, Unata Kukula. <laughs> Ukipiga tunaendelea. Uh-huh. Mm. Mm-hmm. So nataka kuanza sasa. Mm-hmm. Vowels. Uh-huh. Do you know the vowels? Can you sound them or say them? Vowels. Mm. Mm. Sikwanza na faulize mtu alisoma hadi class <laughs> sawa <laughs> Ulizoma hadi class ngapi Jo <laughs> <laughs> ulizoma hadi class Siji <laughs> siji hmm? A E Staki kumalizia jo hiyo ni ujinga <laughs> Wow. Nimekubali mimi ni mjinga. Nimekubali Nairobi. Nimeko na na huruma za Mungu. Kwa sababu Mungu ana mashini unaendesha bro. Ndio si mashini ya huruma za Mungu. Si huruma bana. Lakini si kusoma. Easy masomo. Easy masomo kazi ji boys. Aya. Let me give you a simple one. Rainbow colors iko ngapi? Hey hey hey. Zilikuwa zilikuwa saba ama ama zilikuwa ngapi correct that's the correct answer yeah. seven need there you go that's the correct answer yeah <laughs> what i mean is simple i qualify yeah you qualify hey, right. <laughs> <laughs> no hi hey guys <laughs> you see me uli somea primary school gani mm so my primary schools mingi no wonder siko na shika kitu the last one ama the your favorite <laughs> Uh, my favorite is uh, Morning Starlight Academy. Morning Starlight. Starlight. Iko Miharati. Eh, miharati. <laughs> <laughs> miharati. Miharati ni kipipiri. Okay, sipa ju huko, mm. but it's fine. But ni Kenya, sindio? Mm. Oh, Nyandarwa. Mm. Oh, yeah. Najua Nyandarwa Mountains though. Mm. So, Nyandarwa Mountains. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay. Then high school? Mm. Nilimalize na ito Mwetaithia. Mwetaithia High School. Mwalimu mgani alikuwa your favorite? Ula alikuwa kingevu kwa like, yes! It's about to go down! Alikuwa ito teacher Yunis. Ehe. So msalimi ya jamani. Salimi ya teacher Yunis. Teacher Yunis, mambo. Wewe wata kupinja malimu macho wewe. Muna pinja malimu macho. Alikuwa favorite too. Alikuwa na kufraisha na nini? Kila kitu. Masomo. Venya naka. Kila kitu likuwa sawa. Kwa ni nokitiche. Na tisha mgani alikuwa mtiaji. Ula alikuwa kinga hivyo masikia mechoka. Mr. Kamau had a bus. Mr. Kamau? Mr. Kamau alikuwa mtiaji jia. Yendo alikuwa nambio. Ehe, 
Walio sema sitaenda mbali. Hapa <laughs> ni wapi? Unaona <laughs> so. Ji <laughs> yeye, yeah, yeye alikuwa mwalimu wa hesabu, mimi siko ashika hesabu sana. Ehe. Uh-huh. So nakumbuka siku moja nilienda tulienda games jana. Nikapewa chance, unaona venye unaweza pasiwa ball. Yeah. Football. I used to enjoy playing football, but like I told you tukianza, yeah. si ati najua football, si ati nilijua kucheza, but Fun off. na enjoy to kucheza. Okay. So what happened? Nikapewa, nikapasiwa ball toka huko. Si kakuja hapa ni mimi na keeper. <laughs> Kauza. So mi, mi nataka ati nifunge na nyuma na kisigino hivi. So si nikafanya hivi kapita chobo ito nikaenda. <laughs> so the following day, Mwalimu wa hesabu anakuja kufunza na mimi. Ananiuliza swali. <laughs> swali ya hesabu na shindo. Eh. Anasema ini ngombe ya mtu. <laughs> the same same. The same same way she gets abu. Hata ball jana niliona anapasiwa hapa. Oh, Inapisa yeah. katikati ya miguu. So he, I think he used to hate me Mr. so Kamau. much but well. Hebu mpe message. Muulize hapa ni wapi? <laughs> Alisema utafika mbali hapa ni wapi? <laughs> no, I just wish him the best. <laughs> ah, Mr. Kamau hapa ni wapi? <laughs> Mr. Kamau umekuja miale. <laughs> <laughs> Umekula e, e, special. <laughs> ah, huyo huyo anajua hata anajua ni yeye na ongelea Mr. Kamau. Amejua. Mm. They know of course because mm. they watch. Mm. But ukamaliza vizuri, life ikaanza kuingia. <clears throat> yeah. Before we get into the story for how you got into DJing mm. as a career because I knew as a DJ before you got into music yeah. uh, before getting into that quick question uh, what do you call a baby frog Sasaki. Mtoto wa chura anaitwaje wakati tu chakula imekuwa tamu Leo sio ni ukikula kwa kipindi a baby frog a baby frog Hata wewe ni ananiangalia wajibu. I give up. Weka kuku chini. Weka kuku chini. I don't know. What's the name of the pole? Tadpole. 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 Yeah, yeah. And what do you call a baby pig? A piglet. Very nice. Hiyo iko sawa, hiyo iko sawa. Unaweza endelea kuku. Na kuridim, ni huruma na kuonea. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, uh, you started as a DJ. How did you become a DJ first of all? Because me I knew you as a DJ. I went to System Unit. Ah. Yeah, DJ more. Okay. <clears throat> Back in 2015. Okay. Um Nikasoma hapo tukafunza vizuri. Uh, luckily I was one of the best students because I really had passion now to mix music. Yeah. So me at the before ni malize kusomea DJ ni kuanza pata kazi. Okay. And um nilipata kazi kwetu Nyandaro Kinango. Ah uh, nikaenda nikakuwa DJ huko nikapiga shughuli mwaka kama moja kidogo hivi 2016 nikaisha 2017 ndo nikakuja Nairobi. Kuja Nairobi nikapiga kage aka resident DJ wa klabu mbili tatu kisha nikaona acha nianze kutoka toka hivi freelancing juu nasikia nime perfect sana. Hivi sasa. Yeah, mm-hmm. so Mungu akanisaidia nikaingia hakuna club yenye naweza sema sijacheza. Hiyo enzi nikiwa 2019 hapo hiyo hiyo enzi ya 2018 2019. Eh hey, nimecheza club. Unyoroshwa. Ka zote? Yeah. Uh, and uh, i, i, i crew inajitanga sailors gang wakakuja na wamlambez. Uh-huh. I used to know one of the guys and it shall kid do juka alikuwa kanapenda ku MC so niki DJ nilikuwa nakapea chance kanachukua microphone kana kana, kana hype yeah. so kakanitetanga kwa mwalimu Recho mwalimu Recho akanichora kazi nikiwa DJ wa Sailors Gang ili nisaidia sana kujiposition na kujua Kenya naweza fanya juu ah uh, hapo ndo penye nilitoa usanii wangu hapo ndo penye nilijua naweza imba Nilitamani sana Kenya naona naona vijana wakitengeneza pesa mingi sana yet ni wa young mimi ni DJ hapa tu mimi nachukua pesa kidogo you know as in nika feel nika feel challenged sana and uh, I really thank them because uh, they made me be what I am today and uh, 
nikafikiria hivi na hivi naweza piga line gani yenye inaweza ingiana vizuri nilikuwa nishaandika hadi gengeton gengeton noma <laughs> sikutanganya by the way uh-huh. so uh, after nimeandika uh, pita mirako baby akaniambia bro ah lakini nasikia uko na sauti nzuri sana inaweza ingia inaweza feature na kitu kingine pia kama mugidhi hivyo kaambia bro uko sure kaniambia eh akaniambia niko na ngoma moja inaitwa inaitwa kiogora kiogora ni kangoma kingine hapo hivyo it was my second song nikaipenda kabisa ni ya kikuyu haya akaniambia niko na nyingine twende tukae chini tumalizie inaitwa tuinoke to ikongo he really helped me akanisaidia hadi kuandika unaona sasa nimeingia field yenye hata sijui yeah. so inabidi mimi nikitamani kitu mimi usomea mimi hata nipende ku shoot hizi vitu zenye wana shoot hapa provided tu niko na interest nitaifanya tu yeah. so pitale ni guide akanishika mkono akanionyesha hadi kuandika manyimbo alikuwa anahakikisha tukiandika ananiachia stanza kaa mbili mimi ndo mwanaandika so ikafika time hadi aka akaniachilia mimi nimeimba sasa so nimekamkuimba after tw- covid ime strike 2020 uh, january hapo uh, ndo nilitongo mangu ya kwanza so mimi nimehit na covid nika nikaimba ngoma yangu ya tatu wakati watu walikuwa naambiwa sionekana wawili wawili ama watatu mtashikwa uh, nikaimba ngoma ilikuwa inaitwa demanga mm. demanga was my it was my song it was a banger bro ili ni yeah. so and i thank god you si watu wengi wenye uhit wakati watu yeah. wengine wanalia kila mtu alikuwa analia na mimi pesa yenye niliguza hiyo wakati sijaiguza kwa maisha yangu ngapi Ah tinga bitch. By then you know. Uh, nikisema pesa na manisha watu wengine walikuwa wanajaribu kutafuta hadi food hiyo time ya covid yeah. yeah. Mi hiyo time manga ikitoka natumiwa doa hadi na mafana natumiwa ka, ka 50,000 a day. Hakuna kazi nimeenda, hakuna kitu nimefanya. Kila mzee unaona hadi wasema ma club washaanza kunibuka wananiambia wewe covid ikiisha wewe utakuwa utakuwa big thing hata ni covid inakuzuia so mi mi niko tu ile ha ni sawa wao wanazituma kuzituma na pokea and yeah. i thank god for that because nilijikaza hadi covid ikiisha hivyo nilikuwa nilikuwa na shows ka karibu 100 wow yeah. wow back to back back to back back to back sasa na na misa kenye kenye naweza kuambia ni ati a uh, kuna venye demand iko juu ilianza kulipisha kaa venye wako juu ilibidi ni confirm of course na up to now uh, only that's ya kwa nikipiga show na juu na juu for the past three months yeah. or four months but uh, yule Mungu tu mwenye alikuwa amefanya ile kitu yetu ndo atafanya hii time atafanya hii kitu tena mm, yetu akona njia zake demanga Yeah. Mwomboko. <laughs> Mwomboko imekuja baadaye. Mwomboko I love Mwomboko. Mwomboko imekuja baadaye. In the industry mimi nikiingia uh, kwa hii game, kwa hii game kuna mambo mengi. Yenye hata mafans wetu hawezi jua by the way. But ukiingia na Mungu akupatie hiyo opening ya akili, you really learn a lot of things. One is mimi niliingia nikapata ngoma ilikuwa inaitwa tokenywa, tokenywa toki. Ni mtu anaitwa Josega Tutura. So hiyo ndo nilipata ikiwa juu. Mimi na mimi nikaingia. Nikaingia nikatoa hiyo demo nga. Demo nga ikaenda hivi. Yaani Mungu ni mwema ikaenda kuenda. So ikazimai kidogo hiyo ya tokenywa tokenywa. Mimi nikiwa nimekaa kama mwaka kama moja hivi na demo nga yangu. Unajua ngoma ku hit. Ngoma kuna tofauti ya ngoma kujulikana na ngoma ku hit. Ngoma kuhit ni venye unasema demanga yet wewe ni mnaijo <laughs> mnaijo uh, so uh, ina, ina wewe ni mnaijo na unasikia unajoji na demanga it means hiyo kitu ime hit yeah. but kujulikana kuna ngoma tu naweza kwambia kai hiyo yangu tu ino kia toikongo ni ngoma nikakuimbia sasa hizi nisema yo mbodhe karere maybe unaweza sema nishaisikia but are you pay attention so kuna tofauti ya kuhit na kujulikana so mi demanga yangu iki mehit 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 Mungu akaamsha ngoma sijui ilikuwa imeimbwa 1963 ya mtu anaitwa Dick Monyonyi inaitwa Firirida 
Uh -huh. I know you know Firida. Yeah, I know Firida. Firida ikakuja ikanigonga kitu. Uh -huh. Hey, hey. mi demo yangu na ilikuwa hivi. Uh -huh. Sasa ni dick mwenyonyo hadi. By the way, umzai hananga sauti, but believe me or not. Kana kumbuka nilienda ku perform bad demo sesquiria. Naona sana wake yako hapo ni yeye mwenye ataimba hiyo Firida. I'm telling you, ilikuja wave ni kitu funny. Yeah. Ikagonga, ikagonga de manga yangu. Ikafikiria, kai 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 kai. Yani ya watu wanataku nitawa soko waki na miuna jua. Mitu ndo ni mengi ni kutubwa kwa moja kwa game. <laughs> Nikarudiko vitabu ndo ni kamua kutafta jamana ito kamoko. Kamoko anajua. Ye ndo alinifunza kuteza kina. I know, kio kamoko. So, Very good guy. We decided acha tupige kitu ina ito muomboko. Muomboko sasa... Iliamuka. Iyo ndo imenumia. Hurricane Katrina. Unaona. Fum, pum, 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 pum. Ika enda. Ika songa. Kachi ni kuambie. Mwomboko. It's too unfortunate kusema hivi, but it's the truth, ya. Wame manage kunitoa wakati wame try kuniakachini. Wame manage kunitoa wakati wame wakati kutoa hiyo mwomboko wame manage kutoa hiyo mwomboko wakati wame try kuniaka chini okay so that time is when mwomboko imekuwa ai ai skiki juu ilifika time adi chezi wi dj ya chezi anaambiwa i think hata ilikuwa hatia kucheza ngoma ya ah, i play it when i'm hosting in clubs yeah. anytime when i do kikuyu when i'm normally bigging up the tribes when i get to kikuyu yeah. i always play a samido song yeah. then i'll play weko weko yeah. then i say ah dj kwa naona mugidhi then Dun, 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 and then everybody gets up in the club. Then we just start yeah. doing the train. Yeah. I play, I play it. So, so walikuwa na ikazia? Ilikuwa imekazia. Why? Na hiyo wakati venye ime... <coughs> I can assure you. I know our fans wana Jay-Z V2. They know yeah. it very well. Yeah. Ilikuwa, ilikuwa on the trend. Mm -hmm. Adi, adi kitu match up ondo penye ime. Kuna kangoma kengine kame tokea. It's a nice jam. Hata mi na jam. Na jamia. You know at times... Mm. Wazungu walisema, if the rape is inevitable, enjoy it. Are you kidding me? Wow. So, come on. Come down. Wow. Oh, okay. Yeah, you just have to do it because, oh my God. Okay, you just guessed. Umetokea kwa mwaka ingine kana ito wa, nyoto isu idhabi yuna ihako wa maguta. Ina manisha matiti zi, kuna mafuta. Zi osho na zi pako wa mafuta. Oh, okay. So it's a party song in and away come my dear to the Ezere. That's the trending song. So he's called Kiku Kwa Mogidi. And uh, congrats to them. They're doing a good They're job. They're doing a good job. And that's it. Wow. Na wow. hakuna soa lingine umeni ubeze ikafanya ni sikuni. No, no, no. Ulikuwa ume actually you've earned it. It is. Eh, mm. But that, that's quite a story. Yeah. That's quite a story. That's it. You know, most people always just see uh, like songs come up and uh, artists becoming big and the thing it just happens overnight like now you know myself i used to think when i had uh, the first jam you did so in my head i thought it'll come by accident but with the explanation you sat down with peter he trained you he coached you it, it took time it and most people just think we have a few of those though yeah but pia inaishanga yeah. very fast because i'm a mukaleo kidogo na yeah. Kaveve kazoze na kazi nyandaro ni mawaru. Yes, but now if it takes time and nurturing, mm -hmm. a lot of time, like you, you learned DJing. Yeah. Then you went around, then you came to music, then you've gone around, and even now you're probably learning other skills. I am. And even the situation that happened taught you a lot of things. It did. Now ka evolve, so mekachinu ko like, okay, now this is the plan. Of course, yeah. you have a plan. Yeah. So most people are watching. By the way, it's not easy. Meskia story when you met Oka. Aya, watch a trudi kwa maswari. No, no, no. It is simple. How many days are there in a year? Three hundred and sixty-five. Yeah, very nice. You know, na. Yo, me jibu nakifu a three hundred and sixty-five. Yeah, that's that's very easy. All right. So um, you came, you did everything, and then the big story that happened was Jeff uh, God rest his soul you've spoken about it in different media spaces I think one 
Yeah. Do you feel like when you are talking about it, you are not, the people interviewing you are biased, Ama, they never <laughs> gave you an open platform to express yourself? You know, uh, everybody has their own perspective. Yeah. Yeah, Kitu, yeah? Uh, when they were interviewing me or whoever was interviewing me, I just feel uh, they had already made up their mind. You see? So it was like every other Kenyan or every other human being in the world who was judging me. So it was up to me to even <coughs> try convince them. It's not that way. As the same people I'm trying to convince in the world. So I, I, I feel like there is a level of professionalism that was supposed to be to be considered, you know? But uh, it was it was worth it. In fact after sharing my story, that was my story. And uh, until the day that I'll die, I'll forever say that story because it's the truth. So whoever, you know, watu ni watu ni tofauti sana. Mtu unamwambia hivi, but yeye anataka kuichukua na njia yake. But that is my story. The reason is why I decided to do that interview is because watu waliishi kuniambia wewe huongei, wewe hujaongea. Why are you not talking if then if if you if you don't know anything, why are you talk, why are you not talking? So I decided that yeah. I'm gonna talk. And then Nilishi Kukaziwa kuongea na DCI. Ju investigation iliko inaendelea. Na in fact iliko ni mepe ultimate mukiongea tunakushika. Because they were still under investigations. So Mimi all I had to do was to cooperate. Obina weka weka ikuku hapa. Ukiongea na kuku kwa mkono ikai serious. It's a very serious. It's a very serious. Wake up, wake up. No, but I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. Why are you not going to die? Why are you not going to die? No, no, no. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. So, you don't talk. Don't talk. You talk, Danny. I didn't talk. Because I knew one thing, yeah? I am cooperating. And whatever they wanted to find out, they would. They started with Kasarani. Ikaisha. Kindiki spoke, akatuma homicide, watu hata mimi sijai, mimi sijai shiku hata sijai kwa pingu. Hata juu makosa yote, hata ya kiufala, sijai, hata ya kupigana ama anything. So, mi hata sijuku na department inaita homicide, nilijua hiyo siku. Mutu wamekuja wameanza kukugombanisha huko chini. Sasa unaona enyewe, you are now being treated like a killer. Hani pata? homicide wamekuja haya na hiyo order imetoka kwa kindiki right kidogo kidogo wiki hata ijaisha moja eh hey, director DCI eh, is is requesting you to be in the house tomorrow akuje pia afanye investigation yake he is a senior at that and very tactical huyo mtu anakuja ananiuliza maswali wakakuja kwa nyumba the director himself Sidhani hata kuna kesi umesikia director wa DCI no, he, ameenda yeah. ameenda ku, ku investigate It was a hot case Everybody Ndiyo was huyo, paying attention amekuja. Let me tell you something Abina There is a god in heaven I don't know what to tell you I didn't have the only I didn't have anything hadi ya kuongea ingine wakati mwingine unaongea dimate inaisha Misi kwa hiyo niko na mate mingi by the way ya kiufala hivyo kwanza hadi ya dimate inajichora huku njua venye una try ku explain kitu yenye kitu yenye haiko you know i really understand a life was lost in my in my apartment but listen for instance right now if you happen to give one of your video videographers your car aende nayo saa hizi na ameenda na watu wengine kama wawili. Mmoja ni mgeni wako. Waende wapate accident na hapo huyo mgeni wako akufe. Na kona hapo we hauyuko, unanisikia? Then mtu akuja akulize. 
hey what happened i am telling you it's the hardest thing yeah. in your life where's jibu the thing is it's your car it is now everybody's car. like okay now utajibu nini utasema utasema ulikuwa eh, walienda ku overtake ika akagongwa and let me tell you it has been the hardest thing yenye hadi siku yenye nitakufa sitaweza ku explain ya mtu most of them are telling me ati unafichilia hao wengine acha nikuambie kitu na in this and i can say it hapa wao wenyewe wanajua i have never seen them na macho yangu hivi toka venye hizi mambo zili happen sijai waona na macho yangu hivi sijai ongea na simu simu zetu zote zilichukuliwa zilienda na DCI right i've never seen au kuzo yangu na driver yangu sijai waona na macho yangu so let me ask you something kuna time inafikanga hadi mamako mwenyewe inabidi umwambie kila mtu achalipie makosa zake if they were involved believe me wangeshikwa but sasa hata CCTV yenyewe inaonyeshana mimi after nilitoka mimi siko kwa nyumba kumbe walienda kuniangalia kwa gari nikiwa ni kama ama nilirudi nikazimia kwa gari ndo hao pia wakirudi kwa lift 10th floor wakifungo hivi lift kuna kwa na CCTV hapo inaonyeshana vizuri the footage is there na wanakanyanga hivi step moja kumbe nayo mwili Jeff himself ndo anafika chini the reason is to why Jeff almefika chini you can tell at ni body ni yeye ni mtu wa kuhai ni jua ameanguka kama ameshika simu yake the footage is with the DCI na hiyo nyinyi mtaipata tu itatokea hakuna kitu yenye itokea angi kwa hii maisha na space yenye mtu ametokea tuonge tu kweli Unakumbuka kale ka space tukiwa vijana wadogo tulikuwa tunasema ukiingiza kichwa hivi bora kichwa wako imeingia Mungu mmoja utatoka. Thing is ingekuwa tu unatupwa na watu ungejishikilia kwa machuma hivi na ukatae na nani wa kumtupa kwa nini atupwe. The other question is and this is the question. You are a brand like I am. Do you think I'm I'm that foolish Do you think I am that foolish ati nataka kuangamiza mtu ama kutoa mtu hai nimpeleke kwa nyumba yangu nyumba imeja CCTV toka kwa gate first floor lift everywhere it's full of CCTVs na si ati mtu umeingia kama umeficha ni mtu umeingia hadi mmefurahia inaonekana moments you are very happy so what i'll say is God is faithful. That's the is truth past. will come to light. It will. It And the will. story for the trouser Nikulize swali. Mimi si DCI. So hata mimi nilikuwa nataka kujua kama nyinyi. Unaona venye nyinyi pia mnataka kujua. I also wanted to know about that. Ju trouser yake iko chini. My question na theory yenye nilisikia imepeanwa. Ju that is the job ya investigators. I am not an investigator. So hata mimi lazima ningeulizia hapa kuliendaje. Na naambiwa we suspect that Jeff went out na kichwa. So the last part ya, ku, ya kuguzana na hizo grills za dirisha ni nini? Ni trouser. Unanisikia? Jeff hakuwa na belt. As power wa kisema juice mimi mwenye nilisema. Unanisikia? Then the other thing they said was kuna kitu inaitwa velocity kutoka 10th floor kuteremka kwenda chini obina ujue wewe ni kani parachute so anything yenye uko nayo hiyo ndio inakusaidia ile force ifanye nini i don't know much about that but all i can say is kenya walisema ni hiyo na kulifanywa swaps zilifanywa swaps zilichukuliwa kwa kesi sisi wote tulitestiwa hizo vitu ilionekane kama kama kuna mtu yote mwenye aliwai aliwai lala na huyo kijana my question is who could have done that nyumba iko na wanawake unarudi una vitu zingine 
Which is zingine yes, common sense. Ni narrative During, zingine zinaletwa na watu wenye wana try ku. That story brought a lot of speculation and people said a lot then uh, after the whole story uh, I saw in an interview with Masawe and Jeff's mom called in ama she was called. Walikuwa How did that make you feel? Walikuwa me record your call. Oh. And that was not right. It was not right for Mama Jeff yeah. and it was not right for me as well. The avenues zenye and better avenues zenye you can do it and better ways of doing it. But you shouldn't call that woman mwenye bado ako na kidonda cha kupoteza mtoto wake na ufai uni umpigie mimi eh, mwenye bado niko na kidonda ya kupoteza mali yangu na vitu zangu juu ya kitu yenye sijafanya unanipata so if you want hiyo walifanya ni kama patanisho ready jambo is good for that but then apende hiyo isho ya patanisho kina gidi na ghost yeah? but si kwa hii walifa tu kwa professional kidogo uh, wasi record call mimi usiniambie tu nani surprise unani surprise ati sasa unaniekea recording ya mama Jeff I wish ataongeeka basi wangempigia live wamwambie DJ Fatwa kwa hapa aongee sasa aniongeleshe vibaya hivyo venye aliongea anitukane hivyo venye alinitukana but si wasimpigie pia yeye hivyo they trapped her like they did ata mimi walini trap so hiyo haikuwa haikuwa wise so you cry on that day you felt yes. very bad yeah i did feel bad jia uh I'm going to ask you a very simple question. Of course I can see your camera guys and everything. What's your motive with them? What's your intention to them? Your intentions and your 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 motive is they grow and become something like you. That's why you're in a position Mungu ametubariki differently. You in a position ya kupeana kazi. Hata wao utapata utaita cameraman na akona mtu wake akona right hand wa kumbebea vitu zake so your motive na hawa watu wako ni mgrow wewe intention yako si ati huyu jamaa ende akufie na hapo uanze kuambia umemsacrifice ama umemuua as in i wish mtu angeona hivyo wache kuona vitu zenye acha kuona vitu zenye unaletewa na na media unanipata yeah unaletwa na media na watu wana try kukuweka mimi just to tell you this you all call Jeff interior designer you all call him that naweza taka tuambie mtu mmoja atokea aseme mimi nishayundiwa duka na huyu sasa huyu interior designer only that for me alikuwa ashaniambia kitambo nikinunua viatu kwa shop yake kaniambia na hii shop ni mimi nimeunda ukiwi taka ku set ka place kama aka nitakuundia so time nilifika nimeona god amenisaidia naweza eka ka job ka viatu si ndio nafikiria ya yeah, i remember a guy and he's the right guy wako nifanyia nini ju to be honest ka huna project ka uje kuna project nikuulize kuhusu interior designer unaweza jua si utaanza kutafutilia so kwanza unafikiria anga mwenye ako in mind and that was ju ni kijana mdogo mkue tu mkue pamoja yeah. and that is it so that was it <sighs> well, in that situation au kwa kwa kulijificha wapi mimi si kujificha si nyumba yako ilifungwa oh, oh where were you during all that situation e mambo nilikuwa nilikuwa nakaa na na rafiki yango okay. mwenye sitaki kutaja jina juu ni mtutu mwenye happy publicity so you are locked in the house I was in the Because house during that time a lot of people were begging for blood man I was in the house yeah and uh Roger, during that time if at all you walked any how watu ungefanya mom of justice let me tell you bad. let me tell you something yeah uh it's not like they've started begging for my blood now that Jeff is no more okay and uh that is one thing you need to understand and know as a brand people follow you but deep down in their heart they don't wish you well i can tell you something the same same god that is protecting me right now as we are talking situkonje simuli nita na nimekuja na kivyangu na njia zangu yeah 
mimi utainiona nikijificha na jifitia nani if your conscience are right obina me i see people typing and saying this guy will never know peace i know peace in fact ni venye umeongelea story ya mtu mwenye nilipoteza alikuwa wa roho yangu unaona mm. mtu mwenye a good friend hata unaweza sikia vibaya ukiona story imeenda na imeenda yani na ni ya rafiki yako yeah. mtu mwenye unajua wewe hata bingu ingekuwa nini ama nini unge uwezi omba kitu kama hiyo kifo ndo kitu ya mwisho unaweza takia mtu yeah. nikwambie so i'm going to tell you this yeah uh, si kujificha sana kuna fanyanga watu wasituhami madui zetu tuko nao huku tuko kila wakati that's true but if you believe and trust in god me i love god so much na mimi sijapenda Mungu je story za Jeff. I dare every one of you. Aingie kwa interview zangu zote. Zote utoke za kina Jeff Koinange. Uende za kina Jeff Kuria. Uende za kina Rekeshi Menen. All the interviews andika DJ Fatso interview. Hakuna interview yangu yenye uisha bila mimi kusema venye mimi napenda Mungu wangu because I'm very close to God. Hivi. Na I know. I know most people DC eh enda kadho unasikia kuna time ni, ni nani anatokeanga pale mbele yule eh, I think ni Bikira Maria anatokeanga hapo mbele but sio kila mtu anamuonanga ni mtu mwenye amenyenyekea mtu amejisafisha for those that know god mm-hmm. for those that know god they know very well that god has fought my battles ni kwa nguvu zipi obina wewe tumejuana nikiwa sina hata kiti yoyote ni pesa yeah. gani zenye tuko nazo obina ni pesa ngapi hizi zenye hii serikali inataka sana ati zenye ati mimi naweza wapatia ai bro na kuambia kuna Mungu naki usiwahi ngoja Mungu akuje hapa mkule kuko na ye. <laughs> Mzema Mungu ni vegetarian. <laughs> no, 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 being honest. Yeah. Yeah. Last question. Last question. <laughs> History yetu imesonga we. Last question. Which animal is known as the sheep of the desert? The sheep of the desert. Mfanye hivi mdomo nione. Okay. Mm-hmm. I think yesa Satan bid ni resume kukula juu. Nilikuwa nisha pause. Mm. Sijui <laughs> bado yu umepoza sasa waachia kipindi na ishia hapo. <laughs> yeah. Ni gari it's a camel. Oh, God. imagine, imagine oh, yes. camel. Oh yes. Yeah. So that's it it's my fine. brother. It's okay. Yeah. Uh, uh Are you gay? <laughs> look at me. Do I look like a gay? I'm not gay. No people are saying there are speculations, there were stories. I would want them to even point out one person mm. mwenye nishaikatia mimi si shoga mimi gay na zizi kuwa gay man i i have a soft they said there's a there's a click of uh, some guys you're in that click mwana ndisha mabenz nani nini <laughs> si picha moja itolewe i don't know si so just you know, that to say hiyo si wato... kitu huku iona wali si walianikwa hao wajinga wameanikwa si ni watu wa kirinyaga wenye walikuwa wanapanga hizo ujinga It ah. was a things look at that Gaubare's post. Alionyeshana screenshots zimetokea zote hadi hadi wakinipangia hadi picha zangu zimewekwa hapo. Ni bloggers I think hawakulipwa na watu fulani wa Moya. <laughs> Waka kumbe, <laughs> kumbe the story was yani hadi wameandika vizuri hapo let's call this guy gay. Wow. Ndo tuweze kumshikanisha na yule jamaa wa Moya. Wow. Actually hata hiyo masidezi yake acha tuseme alibaiwa na huyo jamaa wa Moya. Nasikia kisha kuna place nilikuwa na advertise huyo mtu rais yake kitambo nikianza and he really supported me nikianza kuingia kwa, kwa kwa the industry i'll be very honest with you this was a cooked story after all all they wanted ilikuwa tu wanifanye nichukiwe nichukiwe na watu na akinikwambia kitu sikujua unaweza survive kwa hii dunia ukiwa unachukiwa na watu wote Way, Welcome to Jumanji bro me survive aje. <laughs> Let me tell you. Hojani <laughs> angalia. Mimi na kujua na bado niko. Let me tell you bro. Yeah. But one thing I would even love to even tell you. 
hakuna kitu ya maana kwa kujua unapendwa na God. Usihitaji kupendwa na binadamu yeyote. We pendwa tu na Mungu. Mungu akikupenda bro, do I look like I am not gay? I am not. I'll be very honest with you. Yeah. Nikwambie kitu. Nimeishi <coughs> kujua tatu sorry na kuwa na yeah, yeah. my kids Sijani. names kwetu my name kwetu kichora tatu ni hatia yani nimetoka kwa familia spiritual ati inakaanga nika kitu big deal nika nika imelala <laughs> hmm? imeamua kuzinzia hmm. okay so kwetu kichora tatu ni kitu kubwa sana okay haya kwetu kipias ni kitu kubwa sana niliishi ku kujireserve all along at ju na ugopanga na jua kwetu nilikuwa nasikia kitambo ati wetu wenye wamepias wanaitwa mashoga sasa yeah. venye niliona nimeishi kujireserve hivi vyote alafu mnaniita kitu yenye hata sijai kuwa kwa maisha yangu nika nilitoboa masikio by the way <laughs> i did niliamua kukaa maisha yangu <laughs> sio kufurahisha mti yote <laughs> kufurahisha tu god are you dating oh yes mhm Who are you dating? Oh my beautiful. Who is the person? I, I have a beautiful baby. Eh, oh, and it's one Ah yeah yeah. yeah. Mtumie yeah. shirt. <laughs> boy baby boy, ninakupenda. And it's one Eh, jina sitatumia msiende kumfuata lakini. Instagram. No, oh god. Hey. Me, me I am I am. Mko pamoja for long? Like eh naenda mwaka pili sasa. Okay, now assume bear yuko. Who is your celebrity crush in Kenya? ni nani ukipata customer ikiblink mara mbili tatu i take you to be my lawfully wedded wife napita nayo hey. <laughs> for better for worse <laughs> nani huyo <laughs> hey, di bibi ya mtu acha nisiseme <laughs> di bibi ya mtu sema 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 ni nani hey, zi, zi, zi. sinu kusema tu sia tu unaenda kunini uh, uh. niambie pole pole <laughs> uta shout <laughs> ah sita shout promise promise nadia 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 mukami wewe unajua bwanake ni mshale eh eh kadadi akatambe amekumbamba mbaya nadia is a cool lady yeah. anakanga tu vizuri anyway yeah. oh. kila mtu wako sangi hata ukimuuliza yeah. bado atasema ako na watu wake wenye napenda atasema yeah, fat so ah easy ni juu baby hata asante sana my brother Nashukuru. thank you for coming through thank you for being very open and vocal about everything <laughs> thank you i appreciate i wish you can sit and talk much more longer and other stories yeah but uh, wacha hii tu yachi hapa kwa sasa yeah. chakula nimeona kidogo utakula kwa kipindi <laughs> <laughs> But ile umekula iko sawa because uchumi pia ni ngumu. Kwani unataka kupeleka wapi? Siteka wewe sinabeba. Kwani na mimi nawaachia mtu hapa kwa nini? Wacha jamaa yangu akule na yule kasichana. Unaona hata nimekuleta. <laughs> Badhi kale aka ni kadota kangu kwa music. Kuja hapo usalimiane. Aka dota kangu kwa music. Nita aka uta aka uta interview hata hapo. Okay, okay. Let me tell you uh, at least I am proud that nime nimeza, Karibu hapa. nimeza mtu mwenye naweza sema uh-huh. uh, ni ni mtoto wangu wa sanaa. Okay. Yeah. Mambo. Poa. Eh, dani karembo. Hebu zoom in kwako kauso. Nyeli na kavi baya. Forget about the hair. Uh, am I might know here. <laughs> Your name is 07. <laughs> Unaitwa? Ah, uh, Chitrin God's gift Jane. Wewe well, that's a long name. Naimbanga na huyu Morio. Eh, jina ya usanii inaitwa Gasheni. Huyu ndo amenilea music wise. Mm-hmm. Yeah, na kwa pande ya kikuyu I'm the baddest chick. Sema na kikuyu. Ni ni moru hare kirea. Hare ya sio. Neke mani. Eh, besha chigana. Mahoho. Eh, so you are saying she's your protege. Yes she is. Uh-huh. For the two years I've been in the game. At least nimezaa mtu mwenye inaonekana she's a star utamwangalia utamuona and she's gonna be big because whatever we hold na mikono zetu hivi Mungu pia uko ameibless huyu venye sasa unamuona akika hiyo urembo kwa stage ukimpata akikupigia tamasha au tati tati ana perform wapi siku gani wewe ndo promote so gashedi asante sana gasheni yeah, yeah, yeah. it has a meaning ama is just a name it's a name from jen so jen and kikuyu it's gasheni yeah yeah i'm a bit slow it's fine gasheni 
Asante sana. So we'll plan and we have a sit down as well. We'll have a sit down. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Feel free. We'll have a sit down and then we talk more as well. Cindy. Yeah. Asante. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Like watching Instagram and TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, wait. Now yeah. wambi watu ni kona ngoma mpya. Wambi, wambi. <laughs> Hapa sasa hivi. Watu wangu mna onipenda. Na wapenda sana pia. Uh, ingeni pale kwa channel yangu DJ Fatso. DJ FATXO niko na ngoma mpya inaitwa Gadho Adwa nyoba Gadho ni kusema asanti kwa Mungu kwa yote aliyotutendea There you go Yeah and also remember if you want some fire machines magari affordable unapitia pale unaambia bina amekutuma na kupea gari moja poa sana unaweza lipa pole pole usikue na raka na kwa nitakupiga luku nataka viatu zingine stima kama hizi cheki maneno Cheki maneno. No, no, cheki maneno. Talk to Style Hub. Style Hub wanakupea look moja safi unajibama na. Thank you so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe and let us know who else you want us to host and we'll bring them over here. Asante sana and asante sana Miale Lounge for hosting us. Thank you.